So, election is coming up and I want us to ask a serious question. Do we really want another four years of Khan? And I want us to look at this objectively so it doesn't matter what your beliefs are, what your ideology is, your political stance, whatever, whether your issues are to do with race, culture, this, that, you know, put that all aside, you know, because when it comes to the reality of the situation, those things are quite, those things can be quite trivial. And the reality of the situation is four years of London under Khan has just been nothing but destructive and downgrading, you know, and you got to ask yourself, is this what we want at the end of the day? Election is coming up and we have our right to make a decision in what we want in this country. And do we really want another four years of youth homicide going up? Do we really want another four years of knife crime, burglary, rape, gun crime, all of that stuff going up? You know, because what makes it worse is that a lot of it is happening amongst our young culture. And all of those people who support like BLM and this, that and the other, well, guess what? It's happening a lot in a lot in the black community as well. And this is stuff that BLM ain't talking about. BLM ain't addressing the destructive youth culture that is going on in our community. You know, BLM and Sadiq Khan is not really saying anything about you no, know, Sadiq Khan is more interested in investing in things that perpetuate and influence that kind of degenerate culture and lifestyle then he's in tackling it he's even said this himself he'd rather invest in future days and stormsies people who promote a lot of that rhetoric you know then invest in the victims of the results of what the influence of that rhetoric causes so you know we got to ask yourself do you want to and not only that he's made london a very even more expensive to live in with all the different taxes and charges he's added on you know and anyone with common sense will know that if you make somewhere expensive to live you make it even more difficult for young people to move up which is only going to lead them down more destructive this is only going to influence them to lead them influence them to go down more destructive paths so we just got to take an objective look and look at the reality of the situation and ask yourself is this what you want another four years of or do you want change because if you want change, then you will go out there and you will exercise your vote to make change. Because that's what I'm going to do. So, you know, if you want another four years of Khan, then, you know, that's that's on you. But 6th of May, I'm going down there and I'm making my vote to try to exercise my right to want to make a difference. And I believe people in this country need to start doing the same.